Maher, the ergonomics guy. And what I'd like to talk to you about is right shoulder pain. And this is the biggest problem that we see when we go out and do evaluations, is people will complain about the right shoulder hurting. And the reason is they mouse on the right. So they type here, and then they reach for the mouse. And so they're always out in this position. And you can feel this if you put your hand here on your shoulder and reach out and down kind of over your armrest, you can feel how hard that muscle has to work. Um, so there's a couple simple things that you can do to help decrease that, that reaching. Um, the first thing is you want to have the keyboard and the mouse at the same level. So if you're typing here and reaching out and down, that can put more stress here. The other thing is with this keyboard tray, since the mouse platform is below the level of the keys, you can't bring the mouse in closer. You're always reaching out. So what you can do is get one of these. A lot of times I'll just use a book. I'll find a book that's about two inches thick. Or you can just get a thick mouse pad and put it right here. And that raises the mouse up to the level of the keyboard. So now you're typing here and you're reaching over instead of down. So you can get a, a book that's about an inch and a half thick or something, or you can get one of these mouse pads that will fit right here on that platform. The other thing that you can do is you can think about a different style of keyboard. A lot of the keyboards, most standard keyboards, have a number pad built in, which is great if you use the number pad. But we see a ton of people that never touch it. You say, do you ever use your number pad? And they go, what's that? So they don't even know that those keys are there. They just have ignored them. And they're kind of like the flyover states, right? So you got to go over them to get to the mouse, but that's going to put more stress on your shoulder. So what you can think about doing is getting a keyboard without a number pad. And so what they did is they just lopped off the keyboard and you can see that there's a pretty good difference in, in overall length. And so you can put this on the keyboard platform and if you have a single level platform, um, this one is a Workrite banana board, and it's built that way. I digress, but let me tell you, this is the banana board, and the reason it's there is so you can very easily slide the platform to left or right. So you can mouse on either side, which is nice because it gives your right shoulder uh, a break from mousing. The problem is sometimes it's just a little bit too low. So they do make single level platforms that would bring the mouse up a little bit, and that works really well with these shorter keyboards because now your keyboard would be here and your mouse would be here. And so instead of reaching way out here, you're just reaching over. Everything's a lot closer, a lot less reaching, a lot less stress on your shoulder. So if you have any questions about this or if we can help you out with any other aches or pains you're having at work, please check us out at theergonomicsguy.com or give us a call at 925-377-0199. Thank you.